A Jupiter mom accused of child abuse is looking for a new attorney this afternoon. Tracy Ferreter's attorney initially asked to withdraw from the case because she was taking another job. But today that attorney gave a different reason. Josie Carbonari was in the courtroom this morning and shares where the case now stands. Tracy Ferreter's attorney requested to withdraw herself from the case. She says there are irreconcilable differences. What those differences are, however, were not made clear. In an indigency hearing for Tracy Ferreter, the judge went ahead and granted her attorney's motion to withdraw as counsel. Based on the fact there is a conflict, the judge also denied the motion to continue to trial, giving Tracy Ferreter until next Friday to have her attorney file a notice for appearance. When that happens, the judge made it clear any attorney Ferreter gets should be ready to address the court and outline how early they can continue to trial. Up until this point, a trial date hasn't been set. The indigency hearing comes just weeks after Tracy Ferreter's husband, Timothy Ferreter, was sentenced to five years in prison and five years of probation. He was found guilty of aggravated child abuse, false imprisonment, and neglect of a child for locking his adoptive son in an 8x8 box in the couple's garage. His former criminal defense attorney also filed a lawsuit against him, claiming he still owed more than $62,000 in legal fees. As for Tracy Ferreter, it's still not clear if she will be offered a plea deal. A status check is scheduled for Friday, December 15th. Reporting from the Palm Beach County Courthouse, I'm Josie Carbonari, WPBF 25 News.